today's test segment, we take you to London for a sparky idea. A group of friends who met at art school have created an electric mix, a water-based paint that uses carbon to conduct electricity. They call it conductive paint. We were exploring this idea of kind of technology being everywhere and, you know, why couldn't it be in the, on the surface of a book or on a table or on a wall? And we came up with the idea for um, making a conductive medium that could do that, which, which is how we came up with the idea for paint. We sell it as a pen, this is bare paint, and we also sell it in a jar. And the idea is that you can use this to prototype all kinds of electronics, circuits, interactive surfaces. And the possibilities are limitless. You can build a sensor-lit house, fun birthday cards, a sound machine, or even use it to interact with your wall. One of the cool things about this material is that it has the ability to store a charge. So if we connect a pad of paint or any image that we've drawn with the paint to a power source, it's actually holding the electricity in the black area, which is the paint, which means that if some other conductive object, such as my hand, um, interacts with it, it can actually trigger uh, something, which means that any surface from paper to cardboard to the wall can become interactive. And to do that, all you need is a brush or roller and the surface of your choice. Walls, furniture, clothes. Despite being dark and gunky, this is a product with powerful potential. And you are the one choosing its uses. People email us all the time asking, I've got this idea, can I do this, can I do that? That's always been the way that we develop things so obviously we come up with ideas internally but then we almost reinforce them by checking whether or not okay is that, is that right would that make sense if we did this would you like that or so where can we see the product going well the sky is the limit for bare conductive okay maybe not the sky but everything around us we really see that there's a huge potential in industry for just printed electronics um, as a new kind of way of people interacting with the objects around with them. So some of the things that we see are in packaging or advertising, just like printed posters or boxes that actually interact with you when you touch, whether that's generating a sound or music or triggering a light, so that everything around you becomes alive rather than static. This technology is literally around the corner. We already have projects that are um, sort of exploring the potential of how this can be used. Um, one of the pro projects is um, actually sort of like a postcard, where basically it's a little postcard that you get and you put it into a box and then it plays a song, let's say, maybe of the image on the postcard. So it's definitely, it's not like the future future. This is the future that's here already and we're really hoping to be part of it. The future, that's where this team is concentrating all its energies. <laughs>